Guys, today here in Adobe Wizards, I'll be showing you guys how to make a glossy effect in Photoshop, just like the icon you see in front of you. Uh, you can you you can customize uh, to whatever you want, but this is just an example. So uh, yeah, you guys can just experiment and stuff like that. So let's open up um, a 512 by 512 icon size, and uh, let's just pretty much just make your own icon or whatever you want the glossy effect to be on so let me just make something really quick I just have uh, something like this yeah so I'll just do the same thing <clears throat> sorry AF for Apple Freak which is my main channel alright no let's just do Adobe Wizards that'll be better alright so I have this right here and uh, what you basically need to do, let me just add a little bit of touch here. So we have this um, icon here, I guess you can call. And uh, for this icon, um, we'll add the glossy effect. Now, what you basically do is really simple. Now, first take this tool, the it should be the elliptical marquee tool, and uh, pretty much make a huge circle. And uh, be sure to make a new layer and uh, drag it around right here so it has that glossy effect going like this now after that what you just basically do is uh, color in white what I do is, is color in this white and a new layer obviously you guys can see that you just stretch this a bit and what I basically do is just change the opacity and bring it down that's pretty much it and you have a really nice glossy effect now there's a obviously other ways to do it let me just show you or um, yeah let me just show you that so I'll just hide this I'll make another layer and uh, you, you don't have to use the elliptical marquee tool you can use the pen tool to select what you just want to have the glossy effect like so let's see oh wrong tool sorry oh wait no yeah anyways like I said just use the pen tool if you want um, yeah, so you right click and you make selection. I just make it to zero pixels and ta and uh, new selection. After that, it makes a selection. Like I said before, just fill it in. Oops, sorry. Fill it in with white and just change the opacity down. That's pretty much what I do, guys. It's really simple. A really simple way to make a glossy effect. Um, if you guys are actually an app developer and you guys are making an icon, you guys don't have to add a glossy effect yourself. It actually automatic it automatically adds it adds like this to the icon when you import the image to the app. Anyways, uh, that's just a quick Adobe Wizard tutorial for you guys on how to make a glossy effect for an icon or pretty much any image that you want to apply it to. Anyways, hope this helped you guys. Um, we'll see you in the next episode, guys. Thanks for watching.